Okay, today we're going to be changing a hub assembly on a Honda Civic. It's a 99 with a drum type hub. First thing you want to do is make sure the car is in park, of course. Uh, we're going to go ahead and set the emergency brake for now. Yeah, just so we can jack the car up. Jack is a good thing to have. All right. Good jack and a good uh, um, impact gun. Fingers all ran. Put this on eBay. It's a uh, half inch drive. Looks like a three eighths, but it's actually half inch. Pull your tire off, hub cap off, comes off. Flip your tire around, makes a pretty good seat. I was in here too, not, not too long ago, and uh, so it should come apart pretty easy. Now we have the uh, parking brake set. Now you want to release the parking brake. And actually, first we're going to take off this cap with the parking brake on. So you don't want it spinning on you. That's another reason you left. left the parking brake on. And you got to hit it from all angles. Sorry, my knees in the way. You got to hit it from all angles. Work it off. Put a wedge on there. Bind on you. And we got to start it now, so it should come right off. There we go. Set that out of the way. Now, once again, we got to release the parking brake. Here. There we go. That hub should come right off. If not, you got two holes here that you can put some bolts in there and tighten them equally at the same time and it'll come right off. Alright, nice and dusty. Nothing big. We're going to go ahead and blow that all off. Get all that brake dust out of there. Compressed air. Hold your breath. Do it outside. It's a lot better. tools we're going to need today are we got here a to get it off to get your lugs off of course you need a let's see focus in there 19 millimeter there it is and to get the nut off need a do it this way there we go hey you got 32 millimeter To get this uh, nut off, normally they're night locks, but this one is a just a uh, oh, a little locking a little bend type nut. So. Here and bend it up. 
so it can come off easier. Never use a screwdriver as a pry bar. slide out you can entice it with a hammer you're not going to hurt anything since you're changing it out and this was giving us a rumbling noise at anything over about 20 miles an hour and you can also tell if it's your hub bearing if it's when you go around the corner if one side gets really loud compared to the other side and then going around the corner the other way it'll get quiet all right let's grab our new hub assembly it's all pre greased everything that's pretty much the way they come you can change the bearings out but it's pretty much easier just to do it this way um, especially if you have like some lug nuts that need changing due to being stripped or kind of worn out should slide right slide right on you put your washer back on it's key Nut back on. It's, a, it's actually about a five minute job if you have everything set up. I don't have my torque wrench with me, I'm gonna have to go grab that. But uh, this is gonna be torque to 136 foot pounds, I believe. Again, that's 136 foot pounds. Let's get it on there now. I'm just going to go ahead and do the other side and then I'll torque them both at the same time. Give a little snug fit. And it should spin. Good to go. Torque it. Retap down your retap down your lock on your nut. Right there. And after you're done, just reassemble everything back. And that's how you change out a rear hub bearing on a Honda Civic with a drum brake. Thank you. Bye-bye.